Hello guys, uh, I will just show you how I set up uh, the MIP servo card to be used uh, for the flaps indication. Um, here I have started OC4BA. Uh, I click the config, then I get this windows up and here you can see all my open cockpits modules that was detected when I started config. As you can see I have four servo cards detected on my PC. At this time I don't know I just click this test to set up a new config cockpit configuration. Uh, normally what you do is to select the drive uh, the script and here all my normal plug and play devices pops up um, as you can see both comms have come up as com1 so I just click them out uh, as I really don't know which one is which. Um, but going back to the server, what I do is to I need to link the correct server to the MIP server card. In order to find the right server, I just click on it and now on your panel you should see the server moving. And you do this until you see that the server card or servo you want to be the flaps uh, controller when you found that you just link it to the MIP servo card and then it pops up in the cockpit configuration that's all it's the same I do for instance here I have two comms the same I click on one I have a look at my physical modules to see that it's blinking, the display is blinking and then I can see if that's number one or two and then I just link it in. I take the other one as two. This is the way to set up. You can also check in the SEOC INE definition file that I have set up all this. This was for the cockpit name, the driver and all the modules. That's all. Then I am finished this. You don't need to do this every time of course. This you do only once when you set up from scratch. Okay, see you later.